Twitter users have long lamented the fact that the social media site only allows 140 characters in a tweet. Well, perhaps the higher-ups may have heard those complaints because today they started testing a new system out. A small group of Twitter users around the globe are helping test an expanded character limit of 280. That is double what uh, is currently in existence. And true to form, Twitter users are having fun with the new concept. Someone took Twitter CEO Jack Dorsey's first 280-character tweet and gave it a proper editing, complete with red pen, uh, bringing him back down to the 140 limit. To weigh on this, I want to bring in marketing expert Bryn Weingard. She's joining us from our Toronto studio. Bryn, is this going to work for Twitter? Is it going to attract uh, some new users? Yeah. Hi, Marcia. I don't think so, right? I mean, I think, you know, when you look at what the problems are with Twitter, certainly the character limit isn't one of them. In fact, it's what they're famous for. And so ultimately, I mean, this is yet another baby step in, in how they are ameliorating their platform and their site. Of course, you know, we've seen over the last two years them make all kinds of changes, uh, you know, bringing in the highlights and having new uh, user interface and allowing that with the 140 characters, you were still allowed to put on media, things like pictures, video, etc. So we're really seeing them change again in just the smallest of ways, which is really not the problem when we look at what Twitter, you know, the barriers to usage for Twitter. What is the problem for Twitter? Yeah, so the problem with Twitter, of course, is that, you know, and, and this has sort of been long reported, is for whatever reason, because of the ease, the ease with which people can sign up for new accounts, there is a lot of spam on there. There's a lot of anonymity. There are a lot of uh, bots, we call them, which are fake. They're fake accounts, effectively, designed to follow users as an example that's a service you can pay for and so those types of, of, of things you know there's a lot as an example of pornography and sex bots so we're really looking at a user and a membership base uh, that right now stands at about 328 million which is not a lot if you consider that snapchat is much newer about three years old compared to 11 years old and they have 301 monthly users and so really the barriers to use are that people are do not feel as though it's a platform where there's real authenticity in the message where there's real credibility in who's speaking mm. and so that has been a real barrier to new entrants which is what Twitter is struggling with is the fact that they're plateaued in terms of their new membership and for those that do use it a lot of people like the fact that it's word economy at its best that it, it's it's kind of like a headline or a little bit of poetry or a little bit of a riddle um, do we need that many characters or as one person said on Twitter today, now a tweet is going to turn into a blog? Yeah, exactly. You know, I think that's the struggle is that, and there are certainly quite a few Twitter users this morning who were pretty snarky and salty in their comments because they demonstrated as an example what you could do with 280 characters, which is really more spam, right? And that's the concern is that if there is allowance of, of more characters, you're just going to get more in the way of noise and spammy messaging, and you're not going to get more in the way of quality content because we all know that editing requires, you know, really having to think about what it is that you're going to say. And so so no, it's not, it's not likely that this is going to help them and certainly it is a concern for those who do like Twitter. And you know, this was predicated, at least Twitter says, this was predicated, the 140 character limit, on SMS text message, which is mm. 160 characters. So it's unlikely, you know, people are, are generally sort of used to this and it's unlikely that this is going to change behavior. Yeah, and I think a lot of people heard today about the 280 characters. Oh no, what does this mean for profile users like? President Donald Trump. <laughs> Exactly. Who have done a really good job at working around that limit, right? There's not just applications you can use that allow your tweets to be continued elsewhere that then could be read, but also, of course, as we know with Donald, he'll put in many tweets in a row in order to take on his Twitter rants, Twitter well, rants. It is just an experiment, so we'll see uh, how this turns out. Marketing expert Bryn Weingard, thank you so much for speaking with us today. Thanks, Marcia. Take care.